Do you just get tired of being wise? Yeah. <laughs> Welcome back to Josh and Case, and today I'm joined by the stars of A Wrinkle in Time, Mindy, Reese, Oprah. I literally feel like I'm never going to get this close to goddesses ever again. <laughs> so this is like a bold moment in my life. Oh, and I just you. want to turn the question on to you guys first. Now, you're the ultimate interviewer. What is the one question you guys have wanted to be asked about this movie that you haven't been asked yet? I don't think there's one. <laughs> yeah, there's one. We've been talking a long time. Yeah. I gotta tell you. I think no one's asked us what it'd be like to work with Zach Galifianakis. And he was a joy. Oh, yeah. You know, That's we, right. we had it's one true. scene with him, yeah. and Zach Galifianakis was a treat. He was fun. Wasn't he a treat? Yeah, we were in that cave with him for five days. <laughs> Yeah. Hanging on a rope. <laughs> Hanging on a rope. <laughs> it sounds like a cool, like, cult experience. Yes, it was. Yes. Okay, yes. We discover lots about each other. And he looks like he was in a cult a little bit. He does it. <laughs> no, he does. Man. And he was like your secret crush in it as well, which was a weird dynamic as well. Oh, I love yeah, that. Little little flavor. Yeah, I like to have a little flavor. A little seasoning. A little something, something. I like seasoning. Something. Like seasoning like is seasoning. a good way of working. Uh, something, something. Yeah. Um, you guys are huge symbols of empowerment. I just want to show you, do you ever get to a stage from just like, Oh, I just want to kick back on the sofa and just like not feel so empowered today. <laughs> can we just get tired of being wise? Yeah, <laughs> that's like a good question. Like, I just, can, can we just take it off? Yeah. Right now? Oh my god, can I put my pajamas on? I can't wait to get upstairs and put on my little footy socks. But, you know, pajamas are my favorite outfit, so uh, I, they don't feel so empowering. Mm. But, it certainly is my favorite thing to yeah. wear. Anything that either comes close. I think we're very good at relaxing. Mm. I think we're all really hardworking people, but yeah. we work hard, we play hard, and we're. I think we're all good at taking time for ourselves because that's a big part of. But you always look so good when you're just kind of like hanging. I agree. Exhibit A. Just Draper James, come on. I don't. I well, it's part of that legally blonde thing too. She said, if you look good, you feel good. Yeah. And my grandma used to always say that. So that's why you always look so good. She just always. She did. She would always dress up. She just thought you had to be dressed for the day, mm. and it it made you feel different. Like even like like we flew together, and I was noticing, and I had these like cute jeans, and like a black mm. sweater. I thought, mm -hmm. why don't I have that? Yeah, um, I'm um, sure you do. <laughs> and, you know, I, 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 I'm I sure actually, you look great. You know, you I, have, I think she I have jeans and a black sweater, but why didn't I do that with the boots, y'all? I'm gonna <laughs> do that. <laughs> But you guys are team misses in this, which yeah. I love. I and mean, it's kind of like, to me, the Disney equivalent of Destiny's Child. Let's get rid of <laughs> it. Wow. I am so glad you said yeah. that. Because that scene where they come over the wheat field mm -hmm. and we are standing there, we, didn't we not say? Yeah, it's it like is a Destiny's, Destiny's Child, child moment. Yeah. Yeah. It is. I was like, you got it. You're the first person you to are say the that. First, that is the first time yeah. anyone said that. <laughs> Look at that. But I can imagine you guys literally being like, oh, can you handle this? Reese, can you handle this? Yeah. Mindy, can you handle yes. this? Yes. 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 yes, you can. Yeah. But what would be an ultimate night out with you guys? I would love to know what girls' night out with you guys would be like. We just had one. We had we it last night. One. We just did one last night. That's why we're so punchy. <laughs> good food, good drinks, Idris Elba. That was our last oh, yes. night. Yeah. That is quite the trio. That was a great <laughs> night. Yes. It was really fun. It yeah. was a great night. I like to say we like to squeeze the juice out of the orange of life. <laughs> yes. That's what we did in New Zealand. That's what we're doing in London. There you know? We did it in New York. There will not be a drop of juice left in London because <laughs> we're going to squeeze it all. <laughs> but no, nothing left. We love a good cocktail. Yeah. And not ashamed to say it. Okay. See, juice. this is what's interesting. Until I met them, all of my friends, Ava DuVernay doesn't drink. Gail King doesn't drink. <laughs> Stedman Graham, all these years, not even a sip of anything. Yeah. These are my drinking friends. <laughs> we drink, we're making up for time. Yeah. Yeah. We're making up for time. Yeah, I love it. This is literally goals right up. now. This is what I want We caught up last night. Then yeah. we all the drinking that hasn't happened. This is good. Josh, you're going to have time. Oh, Josh, wait a minute, one more. more Come on, Josh. Josh we've been going on and on. Now, I just want to give you guys something, because you are my ultimate babes. So, you get a babes badge. <gasps> Thank you! You get a babes badge. And I get a true babes badge. And true Oprah style. You get a babes badge. Uh, and Oprah. And what does it mean badge. to be a Josh babe? It just means you're the ultimate like queen of life, basically. Oh, I love that. Yeah. That's very nice. And that's what you guys are. Yeah. All right, babes. Thank you. So, we're Josh babes. You're Josh babes. I'm Josh yeah. babes. Josh babes. You look so fab. Thank you. Great. Okay. We bathe for you. 